Well, hello, and welcome to the FF12 Grandmaster Show. Um, John0456, YouTube name, um, or John Anthony, um, known better by my FF12 Grandmaster ID, and also known as Inkataram on GameFAQs. Right, I was asked the other day by a friend of mine if I would take a look at something in the game and see what I could do. Um, so, I decided I would do it. The thing I was asked to look at was the chest in Mount Baromesis. Now, there's probably quite a lot of new players out there don't even realise that there is a chest in Mount Baromesis, but there is. It's only a 5% spawn chance, but it does contain a dark energy, which is very nice, especially at that early stage of the game. But it's the usual thing 5% spawn 1% chance to get it out and of course there's no way to use the RNG helper or any kind of manipulation because it's a non-combat area so you can't even cast cure to find out where you are in the RNG but I put my head to it and I've cracked it and it, after you've watched this video you'll be able to haul as many dark energies out of that chest as you want to now one thing I will say before I start this is that I've done this after defeating Judge Bergen now the RNG moves in these non-combat areas based on NPC movement um, are the NPCs different before defeating Judge Bergen than after yes I think they are will it make a difference I've got absolutely no idea um, I haven't got a file that I can test it on uh, previous to this one so if, it, if you do it before you defeat Judge Bergen and it doesn't work that's probably the reason why but I don't know it may well work fine I just wanted to make that point straight away at the beginning um, so anyway the usual thing this is or as usual based upon Rex's cure values um, so I will load up Rex in a moment and get, give you the cure values. Now, these cure values are actually a little bit later than the ones that I've been using in my guide. So those that have been struggling to get to the start of the RNG will probably have a lot, a lot easier time with this because the numbers are, you know, probably, I don't know, 10, 10 or 15 later than normal. Anyway, um... The auto save that you need, you need to make a save in Mount Baromesis just beyond the zone line in the temple area. You can't do it from the temple at this stage because you can't get in there. But um, just go under the arch uh, uh, um, over the zone line and make your auto save there. Obviously, make sure that Van has got the diamond armlet on because uh, obviously you won't get the item without it. Right. I'll, while I'm talking, I'll load uh, Rex up. Um, don't worry if the screen just goes black here, because sometimes the uh, PlayStation just uh, blocks out the the loading scenes. It just gives you a black screen, but it is loading. Now, I, I worked out how to get this uh, chest to, to spawn, and it took me a little while to figure out how to get the item out. But it's uh, it's actually quite simple. In fact, this is so simple, anyone can do it, really, seriously. Even those in idiot land will be able to do this. Um, it doesn't take any thought at all. You just have to be use a little bit of common sense, you know. Um, but anyway, the first thing to do is to give you the cure values for Rex now. Those cure values are 97, 90, 92. They're the numbers that you're looking for. So that's what I'm going to be aiming for with Rex in a moment. Now, when you load up your auto save in this, in Mount Baromesis, you've got to have your analog stick pushed forward, ready to move instantly, because you have got about one second leeway in this. If you, if you take any more than a second longer than I do for it, you ain't going to get it. 
the RNG will zip on and you'll miss it. So remember that, I'll remind you again when we get to it, but you must have the joystick or the, the left stick pressed forward so that you just move off instantly. Um, this can actually be done on turbo mode as well. I wouldn't advise it because, you know, if you bump into something and, and you stop or whatever, it's going to throw you off. And like I say, you've got one second leeway in this. That's it. But it's not difficult, as you'll see when I do it. But I just want to make that point that when you start that, um, that run in Mount Barometer towards the chest, then make sure that you're moving instantly the moment that the save file is loaded so let's get on with this um like i said the cure values for rex 97 90 92 and they're quite a way in 94 where's that starting 94 97 87 is this 88 yeah 88 i've actually started a bit later these actually are, i'll top the mp up these should be the three values now 97 90 and 92 they're the values that you need that will spawn the chest in mount barometers so now just time to load the auto save um, so usual soft reset and load up the auto saving map barometers again don't worry if the screen's gone black it is loading like i say the playstation just blocks it out sometimes now it's getting ready to move so i've got the joystick pressed forward already now you don't have to put this on turbo it's a 30 second run roughly just take the shortest route you don't have to go crazy cutting corners, just like take the racing line as they say. So just follow the path. Don't go excessively wide or whatever, just follow it round. Now when you come to these steps up here, you've got to turn to the right, then turn to the left, down the steps and open the chest instantly. There you go, dark energy. Now if you open that chest one second later than what I've just opened it, you won't get it that is it that's how fucking simple this is blind morons will be able to do this you know it's i've explained it it's nice and straightforward it's easy and you, all you do now is go back make another auto save and you can farm as many of these as you like so please i don't want to see any questions or people whining in the thread or anything like that about this it is as straightforward as I've just done it get the cure values load up run up to the chest and open it instantly and you've got the dark energy anyway that's for my buddy Zarko who asked me to do this and uh, I'm glad I've been able to do it so anyway if you like this give it a like in the YouTube and uh, share it with your buddies there's a lot of people who probably want to see this and know about this and uh, yeah subscribe to the channel if you want doesn't co doesn't cost you anything you know I'm not looking to build up a huge channel or anything but I do make vids and if you want to see more of this kind of thing then uh, just click that subscribe button so anyway that's it in a nutshell nice and simple like I said even even the morons will be able to do this one and you don't need any outside help at all other than making a, a save file with Rex. So have fun. Thanks for watching. I hope you get lots and lots of these and make use of them. I'll see you around the forums. Take care. Bye bye.